How's it going guys? Will here with Jupiter Bikes. In this segment, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to properly test your lithium ion batteries for your electric bikes. The first thing you're gonna need is a multimeter. When turning your multimeter on, you wanna set it to the DC setting. And for those of you out there who have a range on your multimeter, you wanna set it to the hundreds. Once you have your voltmeter set to DC and you have your voltage readout set to the hundreds, it's time to start testing your battery. You wanna take your red lead or your positive lead and set it to the plus sign of your battery. And then you'll want to take your black lead or your negative lead and set it to the negative side of your battery. Once these are set, you should be getting a readout on your voltmeter. From here, you wanna test each side of your lithium ion battery, which means you wanna move each of your leads down the line. So you take your positive lead and move it to the next positive, and you'll get a readout on your voltmeter. Then you wanna take your negative lead and move it to the opposite negative side, and you'll get a readout on your voltmeter again. For your safety, we recommend plugging your mail terminal into your bike before plugging in your main lead to your wall outlet. Once you're plugged in, your light should turn on. A green light on your charger indicates a fully charged battery. A red light on your charger indicates a battery that is charging. Recommended charge times are anywhere between two and six hours, depending on the charge of the battery. With Jupiter Bike, my name is Will. I hope this information helps you test your battery properly and please practice safety when plugging in your bike and plugging your battery and charger into the wall. Thank you. Take care and ride safe.